Hey, aloha. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. My name is Master Paul, and I am honored to be a worldwide representative of Dr. and Master Zhigong Sha. I'm honored to be with you here today, September 21st, which is World Peace Day. So this day has been in the works for quite a while. There are quite a few people doing a lot of activities around the world today to support world peace. And I am doing my part by connecting with you here today. And we're going to be working with compassion to bring about our own version of peace in our own soul, heart, mind, and body. And then we can be better servants to humanity. So today is the third day of the 10 days of the 10 Da's. In day one, we spoke about Da I, greatest love. Day two was greatest forgiveness, Da Quan Shu. Today is Da Tzu Bei, which is greatest compassion. And um, I wanted to give a shout out to Facebook because they have made my life much easier in this last couple of weeks. The ability for people to come on to Facebook live stream is happening much faster than in the initial month or two I've worked with them. So welcome Magdalene, welcome Anne-Marie, Ari, welcome Chelsea, Petra Marie, welcome Master Gina, welcome Norma, and Kristen Rojas, welcome uh, Patricia Dickinson, welcome Nicole, and um, I'm very appreciative of you all coming on today. So I have a special blessing that we'll be receiving a little bit later from a beloved subdivided soul of Kuan Yin in one of the blessed statues that I received through Master Sha. And so we're going to receive her Datsabe blessings as well. And I have a special uh, calligraphy card that is associated with the greatest compassion as well. And so it's going to be a wonderful, wonderful day. So let us prepare first. <coughs> I might clear my throat a little bit. I'm still finishing up my purification processes. Welcome, Chris Chrissy. Great to see you. Welcome, Scott. So let us all place our hands in soul light, soul service, hand position. Uh, left hand in front of the heart center, right hand gently pointed upward. And let us connect heart to heart, soul to soul. Closing your eyes. Dear all layers of the divine, all layers of the Tao, all layers of the source, I love you, honor you, appreciate you, respect you. Dear all heaven, all heaven saints, saints animals, temple souls, treasures, lamas, sifus, gurus, all beings of light serving the light side. We love you, honor you, appreciate you, respect you. And we are so deeply honored for your guidance, your love, your presence, your protection, and all that you have brought to humanity at this time. We ask you to please be with us here today to assist in this sharing of the Ten Da's and today Dat Bay. Dear beloved Guan Yin, Ling Wei, Sheng Shi, we love you, honor you, respect you. We ask you to come with your 87 Buddha. And to, as we chant Datsube a little bit later, to please bless us for whatever our requests are so that we can open our hearts and souls to be better servants to humanity. Please bless our finances and bless our abundance as appropriate. Please bless us to be more compassionate to all souls that we can be uh, more aligned to the divine. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And now, dear the Source Soul Song of Love, Peace and Harmony, transmitted to all souls in all universes. We love you, honor you, respect you. We invite all souls to turn on this transmission and to chant with us. Let us begin. Lu la lu la li Lu la lu la la li Lu la lu la li lu la lu la ha li lu la lu la li lu la wo a hai wo 
心儿灵，我爱传染泪，往里应容，和儿母是兄，相爱平安和谐，相爱平。安和谐 ，I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. 好，好，好。Thank you, thank you, thank you. So,、uh, love to welcome Kathy Campbell. Great to see you, Kathy. Cynthia Marie, Elizabeth,、um, Scott. Again, great to see you. Norma, welcome from the Netherlands. Anna Ferris, and Johnny, Stephanie Jutia. Great to see you, Stephanie. Master Sandy. And Kristen Strachan,、uh, welcome all of you. So happy to see you. the holy beings have definitely joined us. My nose is itching. Started up、uh, just as I started the invocation and ask all divine, all layers of divine Tao and Source to join us. Welcome, Sarah. And so today is day three of the ten days of the ten das. Now these were brought to humanity through my spiritual teacher and father, Master Shah. And all of the wisdom and information that Master Shah brings is through the divine, through divine flow. Over 20 books, 10 of which are New York Times bestsellers, and all of them flowed. So he, of course, takes no credit for any of the the wisdom, the miracle healings, all of the things that are associated、uh, with the tremendous wisdom of the soul world that is brought to us, including the nature of soul. Heal the soul first, and every aspect of life. Will transform as well. Heal the soul first, and the mind and body will follow. The first day was the I greatest love. The second day was Da Quan Shu greatest、uh, forgiveness, and these are in relation to the information in Master Shah's newest book, Soul Over Matter. And so, in working with the wisdom from this book. He has explained to us that flourishing in every area of our life can be positively impacted if we can clear our blockages to these ten das. So, for those that are not familiar with all ten, greatest love, greatest forgiveness. Today, greatest compassion. That's the bay. Then there is da guan ming, greatest light. There is greatest humility. Da, there is great. I, I forget some of them right now, so I'm just going to say the English words: greatest humility, greatest harmony. There is greatest flourishing, da chang sheng, da chang sheng. There is greatest gratitude, one of my favorites, which is da gan un. There is greatest service, and finally there is greatest enlightenment. Each one of these. Can be of benefit to us, or if we are not doing enough or in alignment with them, can inhibit our flourishing. So the more we release the blockages that keep us from greatest forgiveness, or that keep us from greatest harmony, then the greater flourishing in all aspects of life we will have, including our finances and all forms of abundance. So, I want to read first of all <coughs> from one of Doctor Master Shah's books on. The nature of Datsub Bay. Now, this is practice three for those that do have the book on page ninety-five. Welcome, Joel. Welcome, Cheryl. Great to see you both. So, reading from his book for this practice, Datsub Bay, greatest compassion means Datsub Bay means compassion. It means greatest compassion. Compassion boosts energy, stamina, vitality, and immunity. There are four sacred phrases, sacred key wisdoms of the Dat Sabe. San Dat Sabe, Yuan Li, Zeng Qiang, Fu Wu Zhong Sheng, Gong De Wu Liang. 
San Datsabe, San means three, or third. Datsabe means greatest compassion. San Datsabe means that it is the third of the ten Das, which is the third of the ten Da qualities of uh, greatest compassion. Yuan Li Zung Chang. Yuan means will. Li means strong, strength. Zung, Zung Chang means increase. Yuan Li Zung Chang means increase willpower. In ancient wisdom, compassion increases willpower. Compassion carries strength to transform business and finances. And so Magdalene, the book is called Soul Over Matter. I know it's backwards in your image, but it's called Soul Over Matter. It was just released about uh, two months ago, I believe. Very new book. And so, um, it isn't interesting to think about compassion increases willpower. So when we are not sympathetic, but empathetic, when we are compassionate for other people's conditions, that actually brings power to us. Interesting, huh? Gong de Wu Liang, or excuse me, just before that is Fu Wu Zhong Sheng. Fu Wu means service. Zhong Sheng means humanity. Fu Wu Zhong Sheng means serve humanity. Gong de Wu Liang. Gong de means virtue. Wu Liang means immeasurable. Gong de Wu Liang means immeasurable, immeasurable virtue. So these four sacred phrases can be summarized as follows. The third of the ten da sacred soul over matter practices is greatest compassion. It increases your willpower. You will serve humanity with greater compassion and the virtue will be immeasurable. So this is the teachings specific to the practices we're about to embark upon. A Mother Earth, a person works for a company. At the end of the month, he or she receives a salary. Salary is the company's appreciation for the employee's work. In the spiritual realm, when a person offers love, care, and compassion to others, heaven will give that person virtue, which is heaven's appreciation and flowers. Heaven's flowers are deposited in the person's virtue bank account in heaven. This spiritual currency can transform to physical abundance on Mother Earth. Have you ever heard that before? Some that are Master Shah students know. Those that are not though, virtue in heaven is equivalent to financial blessings on Earth. So we have Earth money. If we do good things with Earth money, we get virtue in heaven. If we do unpleasant things, the virtue that is in our virtue account in heaven that brought us that financial flourishing on earth will start to diminish because we're not using our, our financial blessings on earth correctly. So it's a, the rain comes down, evaporation goes up. Rain comes down, evaporation goes up. Heaven's virtue comes down in the form of financial flourishing. If we don't use it well, it does not go back up, therefore we don't get more of it and vice versa. Hmm? Deep wisdom. Greatest compassion, that's a bay, boosts energy, stamina, vitality, immunity, and willpower. And these are the vital for financial and business abundance. Let us do a soul over matter practice now to apply that bay to bless your finances and your business. So we're going to use the four powers. So first, <coughs> We're going to do, um, let me read this real quickly, make sure, yeah. First we're going to do a forgiveness practice, and then we're going to do the four powers, and we'll do some, we'll do some tracing, and I'll ask our beloved uh, Kuan Yin, and um, this special card that I have to bless us all today, okay? So place your hands in soul light, soul service, hand position, left hand over your message center, right hand gently pointed towards heaven. Start out basically like a prayer position. We just drop the left hand in front of our heart center. Okay, very simple. Master Shah refers to it as the uh, uh, soul light, soul service hand position. Okay, close your eyes. Let us fully connect. Forgiveness practice is very integral to our positioning and financial abundance. 
Please repeat after me. Dear Divine, dear Tao, dear the source of all life, I love you, honor you and appreciate you. I ask for your forgiveness and your blessings today. Dear all souls in all time, if I or my ancestors have brought harm or suffering to you that has kept you from having abundance in every aspect of your life, if we, I or my ancestors, have cheated on you, if we have been greedy, if we have been deceptive in our business practices, if we have done anything that has caused a lack of financial flourishing in your life, I sincerely, sincerely apologize on behalf of me and my ancestors. We wish to never make these same mistakes again, and we ask for your forgiveness. We are very grateful for this opportunity. If you have brought harm or suffering to me and my ancestors, if you have limited our financial abundance or any form of abundance, we wish to offer you our unconditional forgiveness. We understand you may have brought this suffering to us to remind us that we had done something unpleasant to you. And we offer you our unconditional forgiveness and we ask for yours. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And so now, with your feet flat on the ground and your back away from the back of the chair, we're going to continue with blessing. Place one hand on your lower abdomen, one hand over your heart center. Keep your eyes closed. Repeat after me. Dear soul, mind, and body, of myself. Dear soul, mind, and body, of my financial and business teams. My team members and leaders on Mother Earth. I love you, honor you, and appreciate you. Let us practice compassion to increase our willpower, to boost our energy, stamina, vitality, and immunity. Do a great job. Thank you. Dear Source, dear Heaven and Mother Earth, dear all saints in Heaven and on Mother Earth, dear Datsu Bay, greatest compassion, dear Kuan Yin, and the Datsu Bay calligraphy card that Master Paul will serve us with. We love you, honor you, and appreciate you. Could you please bless my whole team in finances and business so that we can serve more and more? The more we serve, the more virtue heaven will give to us, the more flourishing could come to our finances and business. We are very grateful. Thank you. For visualization, focus on your heart area and see golden light shining and your finances and abundance. So I will use a 900 frequency calligraphy card I received from Master Shah to bless all of us, as appropriate of course, and I will call upon our beloved Kuan Yin and whatever way she wishes to offer blessings to all of us at this time. If you know the chanting, please chant with. If you do not, keep your eyes closed and visualize golden light coming into your heart center, clearing the blockages. Datsubei 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 Datsu 
Greatest compassion, greatest compassion, greatest compassion, greatest compassion. That's the Visualize beloved Kuan Yin, her 87 Buddha, coming to you, surrounding you, blessing you, waving their healing instruments, blessing your heart chakra, clearing blockages, blessing your finances, blessing your heaven's teams. Datsube 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 Greatest compassion, greatest compassion, greatest compassion, greatest compassion. That's Greatest compassion, Quan Shur Yin Pu Sa Da Tsu Be Ling Wei Shang Greatest compassion, Quan Yin Pu Sa Da Tsu Be Ling Wei Shang Shi Greatest compassion, Quan Shi Yin Pu Sa greatest compassion greatest compassion greatest compassion greatest compassion see the light in your heart expanding see the light in your heart expanding to all humanity with the greatest compassion Continue to chant 
that subay and I will offer a soul reading as to the blessings you are receiving at this time. Datsube 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 Continue to chant. This is Ling Wei Sheng Shur. I am the Saint Soul Buddha of Intelligence. I have been known as your beloved Kuan Yin and as the Goddess of Compassion. My light is your light. My love is your love. Why do I say this in this way? What is greatest compassion but alignment with the light and love that is of the original source? That is what I am. That is what you are. The only difference between us is I have remembered more clearly my original nature. And that is what compassion is. It is the reminder to all souls of their original light and love. You are a compassionate being when you are the light and love that reminds them of their light and their love. I had been asked to attend this blessing and instantly I came with my 87 incarnations. My self-subdivided souls came to each of you and currently is blessing each of your message centers with a wave of one of my 1,000 hands. I am clearing many of your lifetimes of blockages that have kept you from having the compassion, love and light that keeps you from seeing your beloved Creator the way you are always meant to see. These blockages have been with most of you the vast majority of your lifetimes. For many of you there will be a deep awakening, a deep awareness of your role in society today. The opportunities to serve will be revealed to you. There were a few souls who were almost lost on their soul journey and for those very special blessings have been offered to fully open and remind you of your purpose on this path. There are some of you who are quite aligned and received additional blessings to open more your spiritual channels that you can be the servant you desire to be. For all of you, virtue has been deposited into your Akashic records. This virtue is to be released upon service. This virtue is to be released upon opening your heart with compassion to benefit others by making them happier and healthier. Pay attention. Notice when your finances or more is flourishing and then look backwards. What service did you offer? It should not be that to do service you receive blessings. You should automatically choose to be in that space. But 
this is taught you at this time so that you can start to correlate and understand the nature of the natural workings of the universe. It has been my greatest honor to offer this wisdom and these blessings. I will be present to serve you all through the entirety of this event. This is Ling Wei Sheng Shi, your beloved servant, Quan Yin. Ha, ha, ha. So let us continue. Ling Wei Sheng Shi, Quan Shi Yin Pu Sa. Ling Wei Sheng Shi. Quan Shi Yin Pu Sa Da Tsu Da Bei Ling Wei Sheng Shi Greatest Compassion Quan Shi Yin Pu Sa Da Tsu Da Bei Ling Wei Sheng Shi Guan Shi Yin Pu Sa Guan Shi Yin Pu Sa Continue to see the golden light permeating every aspect of your body Feel the financial flourishing, the flourishing in your relationships, the flourishing of your heart, the flourishing of your health. Continue to visualize. That's the way. Ling Wei Sheng Shi. Greatest compassion. Quan Shi Yin Pu Sa Da Tsu Da Bei Ling Wei Sheng Shi Greatest Compassion Quan Shi Yin Pu Sa for those with third eye, please pay attention to what is happening. I will ask you to report your third eye images. Da tsu da be ling wei sheng shi guan shi yin pu sa guan shi yin pu sa Da Tsu Da Bei Ling Wei Sheng Shi Guan Shi Yin Pu Sa Guan Shi Yin Pu Sa Please bless my financial flourishing Please bless my abundance. Please bless my financial flourishing. Please bless my abundance. Dear all souls, please forgive me for hurting your financial flourishing, for hurting your abundance. I forgive you, please forgive me. Greatest compassion, Greatest compassion. Da Tsu Bei Ling Wei Sheng Shi. 
相识，观世音菩萨，观世音菩萨。Please forgive me. I forgive you. Please forgive me. I forgive you. Dear beloved divine, thou and source. I promise to serve with financial blessings, dear divine Tao and Source. I promise to serve with my financial blessings. Thank you, divine Tao and Source, for all that I have in my life. Thank you, divine Tao and Source, for all my flourishing. Please forgive me, divine Tao and Source, for complaining about my financial conditions. Please forgive me, divine Tao and Source. For complaining about my financial life, please bless me, divine Tao and Source. Please bless me, divine Tao and Source. I promise to give back and serve. I promise to give back and serve. Datsu da be lingue shang shi. Greatest compassion, Guan Shi Yin Pu Sa. Please forgive me, all souls who I have harmed. Please forgive my ancestors for all the souls we have harmed. We have learned our lessons. We sincerely apologize. Please forgive us. We are ready to serve. That's a dabei lingueishang shi. Greatest compassion, Guan Shi Yin Pu Sa. Continue to keep your eyes closed. Continue to receive the blessings from beloved Ling Wei Sheng Shi, Guan Shi Yin Pu Sa. Continue to ask for forgiveness. To all the souls that you have kept from their financial flourishing, all the lifetimes that they may have suffered, remember that there are reasons your finances have not flourished. Open your hearts, deeply apologize. I will be silently chanting. You deeply apologize. That's it.
And we are deeply, deeply honored and deeply grateful to all of the holy beings that have come for this practice today. To Blab Lingwe Shangshur Kuan Yin Pusa, to the 87 Buddha, to the countless saints, saints, animals, temple souls, blessings and treasures to heaven's generals and soldiers who have come. We bow our head nine times with the deepest gratitude to all of these benevolent souls that have served us. <coughs> we offer our deepest gratitude to all the souls that have forgiven us in this and all lifetimes. And we say to those that are not ready to forgive us yet, we love you, we understand, that you wish to see us serve more, that we might fully earn your forgiveness. We recognize that we have made mistakes and that we may have harmed other people's abundance. We will continue to serve in hopes that you forgive us unconditionally for the times that we might have brought suffering to you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Divine. Thank you, Tao. Thank you, Source. Thank you, all of those souls. We ask you to please remain through the remainder of this practice. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How, how, how? Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, open your eyes. How are you feeling? A little bit lighter? Did you see anything in your third eye? Did you feel any vibration, heat, change in your body conditions? You were very blessed. Uh, Ling Wei Sheng Shi, Kuan Yin, is so powerful. She brought so many, so many blessings. Her thousand arms were just spread. All the instruments that she carries with her to clear the darkness and to bless us were all moving. Many, many flowers in heaven were offered to all of our Akashic records. There was tremendous virtue that was offered to us here today with a caveat that we must be sincere in our forgiveness, that we must serve to receive the virtue that has been deposited into your Heaven's Bank account. So please share. I saw a couple comments. I'm going to go back to them. Kristen uh, Strachan commented, Thank you, Master Paul, for this powerful practice. My hands fired up a very warm, and she had a quick vision of the painting done by Master Nina of Kuan Yin. Yes, that's a very beautiful painting as well. I uh, keep those. I actually <clears throat> keep it under my uh, pillow at night to serve my, my soul journey while I'm sleeping. And so Suki has commented, Beloved Master, I had visions of Mother Kuan Yin, blessing in abundance for everyone. First was beyond, uh, it was beyond words to express the love she was showering. Yes, I, I, you know, I could feel her her compassionate heart, you know, she's such a precious soul. We're so blessed that we can be aligned to her through our spiritual father, Master Shah. <clears throat> and so she says, dog on in. <clears throat> so welcome Carol and welcome Pat. And while others are writing in their responses, uh, I will connect. You know, one of the things that, that Kuan Yin was flowing uh, through this while I was doing a flow uh, was something that I, I hadn't heard before, and I'm paraphrasing at this point, but she said something about we are light and love, and compassion is when we bring light and love to another, because that's what reminds them of what they already are. And I thought that was a really interesting um, simple way to comprehend what is compassion. 
you know, it was really succinct, actually. Just be love and be light for that other person. That is compassion. We are, in essence, reminding them of what is already innate inside their very being. And in that reminding, we bring that light and that love out. And that's what brings them the healing, what is already inside. We are just a, a conduit by which what is already inside them is being brought to the surface to bring healing to whatever um, suffering they might be going through at that time. <coughs> so I thought that was a really, a really beautiful message that she had to share. So um, you were being blessed this whole time uh, by the subdivided soul of Kuan Yin and this very blessed statue. Uh, this was um, Kai Gong by Master Sha. And um, I, I rarely use uh, this beloved statue and blessings inside of it, <clears throat> but it felt appropriate today for all those that were, um, followed their soul and came to, to be with us here today. I also used this card. Now this is the um, uh, Datsube card. This is three words, Datsube, and this is done in Ibiza calligraphy. Um, this is one of the cards that, that I was allowed to use to serve. Some of them we are not allowed to use to serve. Uh, this one is, it has what's called a 900 frequency in it. And to give you an idea what that means, um, Buddha's operate at about 800 frequency and divine operates at about a thousand frequency and so this frequency is is exceedingly high that was put into this card and so I was tracing this to serve all of you today uh, and I'm, get, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's where a lot of the virtue is coming from into your virtue account <coughs> so we received some pretty big blessings so I'm waiting to see any comments uh, maybe you guys are all knocked out already I haven't seen any responses as to what are the benefits that you might have received or any of the, any of the observations. So, these 10 days of the 10 Das are uh, very important for each of us to assist us with clearing those things that keep us from having different aspects of abundance in our life. I do, uh, I, I have put forth and will remind everybody, each day, is an opportunity to receive a crown chakra blessing for this aspect. Uh, in this case, compassion. And any place compassion is keeping us from any form of flourishing in our life. Uh, the first day is Da I, greatest love. A crown chakra blessing for the greatest love in any way that is keeping us from having greatest love flourishing in our life. And so each day, uh, is an opportunity to receive a crown chakra blessing. Crown chakra blessings are basically God putting his hand on your head. Uh, I'm a conduit through which that happens. And just, it's like heaven opening up a portal and, and at least 10 lifetimes of blockages, because I checked on how much is removed, at least 10 lifetimes of blockages that would keep us from opening our heart or greatest forgiveness or abundance or flourishing, whatever it might be, are, are being... Um, washed away through the divine power that the crown chakra blessing offers so for those that are interested you can always check with me later on that um, I'll keep it open for 10 days after the completion of these 10 days and uh, you can choose to get one or all of them it's completely up to you um, but I encourage you to tell other people about it because it's a very rare opportunity and so I see a couple of comments uh, Welcome, Shanice. It's the first time I've seen you. You've probably been watching, so thank you for, for joining. She says, wow, powerful blessings. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Guan, Guan Yin, uh, Divine Dao and Source, and Master Paul, Master Shah and Master Paul. Thank you, Master Shah. Uh, I felt pressure in her Ming Min and warmth raise up her spine. I also saw white light and Guan Yin showering us with compassion and blessings. She saw babies with wings. <laughs> How beautiful. And she was in the sky then she went into the condition. Beautiful sharing, Sinise. Thank you for those third images as well. And welcome, Carol. Welcome, Consuela. Uh, and welcome, Dama. Um, I I'm, uh, hope that you guys came in and got to see some of the blessings we just offered. The beautiful thing about a live stream is that it's recorded. We just offered about 20 minutes of, of huge blessings, a lot of virtue placed into the uh, uh, records in heaven. So, 
Um, today is World Peace Day. <coughs> and there's many, many activities all over the world on tv.drsha.com, which is Master Shah's 24-hour chanting channel. Uh, there is 24 hours of chanting of the Source Soul Song of Love, Peace, and Harmony. And Love, Peace, and Harmony uh, is pretty much the fastest way to self-clear our karma, uh, regardless of the source of it, regardless of what it is. And the simple reason why is because we're using a divine frequency-based song to serve unconditionally to all souls. And by chanting it silently or out loud, wherever we're at in the world, regardless of what we're doing, we are serving. So it's the fastest way to clear because of the frequency that it carries and because of the unconditional nature of that service. So you can download it at lovepeaceharmony.org, lovepeaceharmony.org. And if you want to become familiar with uh, tv.drsha.com, please go to that and make sure you share with other people. Um, so I see Kathy has commented. Thank you. She felt a lot lighter during the blessings. And uh, Carol says, thank you. You're very welcome, Carol. And then Carol Whitney says, uh, how do we determine which is the most beneficial? Uh, happy Interna International Peace Day to all. Which is the most beneficial crown chakra blessing, I'm guessing, is what you're asking, Carol. Um, I would do a soul reading as to which is the most beneficial for you, if you're unsure. But a good, a good gauge is, if you have a lack of love in your life, probably Da'ai is the best. If you're holding on to forgiveness issues, you just can't seem to forgive, absolutely that's going to be the best for you. If you recognize that um, you're a bit you know, tight in your own world and you're unable to be available to serve others, have a compassionate heart to serve others, then obviously today Datsid Bay would be the best for you and so forth. Um, one of them is harmony. You might find it's, it's difficult to have harmonious relationships with anybody. Nobody seems to like you, even at the job. Then greatest harmony would be the one for you, and so forth. And so each day, um, each theme of the, da, of, the, uh, of the ten da's will reveal itself as to which one may be best. Um, I can tell you that to receive the crown chakra blessing, to, to be able to save 10 lifetimes of your own service and efforts, what does that mean? It's important that you understand what 10 lifetimes means. Virtue is earned through, through service, basically. And so if you were a monk sitting on a mountain in meditative position, eyes closed, visualizing serving humanity six hours a day for 60 years, that's one lifetime of service. Six hours a day, 60 years, thinking about nothing else. That's a lifetime of service. So a crown chakra blessing has the, uh, the, the virtue that is the equivalent of 10 lifetimes of that. I, I ask Kevin, what does is, what is each crown chakra blessings value? What does it do? And so that's what you would have to do to receive the amount of blockages that are addressed, cleared, and new messages, new energy, new power brought in. Not only is the old stuff removed, heaven provides new conditions through which um, the right people, the right conditions, the right abundance lines up to you because the request will be for, and the forgiveness as an example, crown chakra blessing for the condition of forgiveness that is keeping this soul from having financial flourishing in her life or flourishing um, uh, in her life. And heaven knows exactly what that is. They go through and clear it all out, bring in new energy, new matter that carries with it the magnetism to draw to you what it is that's going to best serve you. And that's for each of the ten das. So crown chakra blessings are probably one of the most underrating, underrated divine services because they, they accomplish so much with so little effort. Um, at some point in time, it, it, the minimum honor fee on these will at least be $500 when people comprehend the value of them. Right now, the honor fee is so low because no one really grasps it. But so you're the benefactor of that. So we'll read a few more and then I'm going to have to, to call it a day. Um, Johnny says, thank you, Master Paul, for your powerful blessings after a hectic day. He was feeling very exhausted. Now he's feeling more energized. Yeah, what, did, what was the message? Uh, it, it boosts our energy. First, that's the first thing. Compassion boosts energy, stamina, and vitality. And it increases our willpower. So there you go. Great observation, Johnny. And thank you, Kristen, for posting the uh, two websites, drshaw.com, the TV, the 24-hour chanting channel, and the uh, lovepeaceharmony.org resources for downloading the uh, Love Peace Harmony Soul Song. 
And then Kathy Campbell has responded, I was having a very heavy emotional morning. I want to thank Kristen for helping her out. Yes, you're very, uh, very blessed that Kristen is there to serve you, Kathy. Please keep an open heart. And, and she, she will just uh, be such an open, open servant to serve. Beautiful soul. Uh, Anne-Marie comments. She says, thank you, Paul, for your total gold. Monica as well. And Carol, thank you all so much. Tomorrow, we will focus on the greatest light. Okay. Da Guang Min, greatest light. We will use this to clear all forms of blockages that are directly related to our uh, lack of flourishing in all aspects of life. If you have not seen the other DAWs, go to my Facebook page uh, under the main image, look for About, click on that, scroll down to Videos, and you can watch the last couple days of the other DAWs. Each day is huge blessings, and if you're able to accomplish all 10, you will find that the end of these 10 days, far, far, far greater alignment to the divine and a much happier sense of well-being, okay? So I'm so honored that all of you have come. Thank you all so very much. We'll see you tomorrow, same time, same place. Invite your friends, and we'll see you then. Bye-bye.